And we're back, and there is a. Uh, hey, look what I found. There you go. That's what I was talking I've about. Got a brilliant idea. Yep. Aladdin, 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 or wait, what's the name? Genie. Don't do it. <clears throat> Time for Genie. Oh. Uh. <sighs> wait, did he absorb me? Howdy. Welcome to my home, traveler. I'm Stan, the genie of the lamb. Uh. I know you're going to leave here happy today. How do I know? Because this is the place where multiple reckless wishes are granted. Multiple. Isn't that great? And in return, freedom is given. To whom? Think about it. Three wishes for one of us, freedom for the other. Isn't that great, kid? Yes, sirree, everyone's a winner. Ah, but I see down in your eyes, you're wondering if I'm a real genie. Is that right? Then, let me show you what real magic is, kid. <sighs> Pretty impressive, huh? <clears throat> Left you speechless. Amazed. Hey, what in tarnation? Shut up for a moment. You said I have three wishes, right? One, get me out of this darn lamp, it stinks. Two, destroy the nightmares that are tormenting the little girl. Three, get out of my sight. Forever. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Come on, my friend. That's not how this works. Well, you say you're, you're a genie. You're who has to fulfill three of my wishes. Otherwise, what sense would it make? You what? have only two options. Grant my wishes or stay and rot in this stinking lamp. But since I <laughs> already know what you'll choose to do, for my first wish, I want to be able to fly. Head to the forest of the black fairies and kill them all. We need to collect enough magic dust for me to absorb their power. What are you doing still standing there? Go to the Black Fairy Forest and kill them all. It'll take a lot of magic dust for me to soar like a majestic eagle through the infinite blue of the skies. I hate this guy. This is messed up. But at least I get to kill fairies, which is one of my favorite pastimes. Charming. Anyway, those are vulgar tooth fairies. Don't you dare compare them to me. If you say so. What a messed up beginning, man. What is that? What the? How many hits to kill them? Okay, it's like five hits to kill them both. That's fine. What's the name of this section? The selfishness. Selfishness. Okay. Yeah, I can, I can, I can understand why it's selfish. I mean, the guy just wants us to do things for him. And that's it. Kind of strange considering that he's a genie. It was supposed to be the other way around. But I guess that's the point of this game, right? Everything works the other way around. I mean, I'm sorry. You were in my way. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yo! Oh, oh my. These guys, I swear, that annoyed me. Yeah, they shouldn't be able to... How are they killing me? I died. I... 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 I don't know what to say, guys. That section was horrible. Uh, but it seems like enemies do not respawn. Like, once you kill them, they are dead, they are gone, they are gone, gone, so... So, I guess, I guess the game wants to prevent you from, like, farming them for experience. Okay, careful. I, I, I do not understand this section. It's annoying. I am confused. Jesus! Wow. 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 Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, and their health is actually stuck. But wow, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it. I do not understand what was going on in there, but a little bit of balancing in there would be appreciated. That section right there was horrible. Wait, is that our son? Yeah, we can kill them. But yeah, some balancing in that section would be appreciated. Those two enemies at the same time, a little bit too much. Yeah, yeah, it's it's just a little bit too much that they push you. Because there's nothing that you can actually do. And like I said, you have too many platforms and things like that. So there's 
There's like a lot of limitations on what you can actually do. What the fuck? Does these things have laser beams? Yeah, at the very least we kill them out. This is weird. This game is getting weird. Like those things, like they have laser beams. They are harpies. They can push towards you. On top of that. On top of that, they also... I don't know. It's th Those enemies are weird. That's what I'm gonna say. Can you fall? Okay, you make them fall into the water. Yeah, they die. Pretty easy enemies. How do I grab that? I want that. Give me that. A pure shot. I mean, I'll take it, but we don't have gone. Oh, for the bow. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. That sounds interesting. Let's keep moving forward. Mark this. Uh, uh, I don't know how to deal with this, so let's just jump up. I'm guessing that we have to gain a new power to be able to like take them down. Is that an arm? I do, do these trees have arms? What the fuck? Uh, maybe a fight? Uh, what's go- Dude, those holes are too big. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what, what the- Okay, that's fine. No, oh, careful. Yeah, we're gonna kill this guy. No, no, careful. That's fine. One of them is dead. Pretty weird place. I'm, I'm telling you guys straight up. These enemies are weird. Weird. Are weird and feel a little bit unfair, if I gotta be honest. Like, we went from, like, gingerbreads and things like that. The wolf section was really fair. Uh, which is the beginning of the game, but then as the game keeps pushing, why does it feel unfair? Their armor is too thick. You need a more powerful weapon. Thank you for letting me know. Look, it's moving. We might be able to break through it with the right weapon. Oh, okay, okay. So you're telling me that we need a better weapon. So we're probably gonna be getting a pickaxe, considering that we're killing enemies that have pickaxes. Uh oh, those attacks actually pierce. Okay, do you want to go down? There's nothing that we can do against this guy. Do you probably want to go behind him? Okay, that's fine. Jesus Christ, the amount of health that they have is insane. Uh, we want to go down, right? Yes, let's go down. Let's keep moving forward. Uh, jump. That's fine. Once they give you your back, you can just use your speed and just kill them. Good. Now, now, the amount of experience that every enemy gives you, it seems to be equal. So that pretty much means that no matter what you do, or no matter how many, or what type of enemies you kill, the experience that you receive will always be the same, which is a little bit... Okay, that's fine. Okay, we killed them both. Fantastic. Keep moving forward. Uh, something is going to happen in this bridge. I got the feeling. No, nothing happened. That's okay. Uh, then we have this crap. Yeah, of course. What the heck? Okay, that's fine. I thought for a second that that crap wasn't gonna be able to kill me. Great, what happens if we go down? Oh, we gotta start killing these things. Okay, they're dead. Fantastic. Are we gonna start taking some poison or something? Huh. So it seems like we finally reach out the section for the fairies. Pretty interesting section, but uh, again, it's like, what's going on? Uh, how, how do I reach this? Great. So the way, the right way to go is the way to the top. Uh, again, how many fairies are we going to have to reach and how many are we going to have to kill? How do I reach to the... How do I go up? Wait. If we are here, how am I supposed to reach the fairies? We don't have anything to stop them. There is a clock also that uh that was weird but i mean i'll take that is that a level up no no level up maybe we can do this way oh maybe we gotta go that there is a clock on that side and i do not understand what the clock does and i do not know how to read this place but my guess is that we're gonna have to dodge all of this yeah, that's fine. Uh, nothing that we can do in here. Nope, that's okay. 
Okay, there's no actual point for us to do that. I thought for a second that there was gonna be some sort of secret in there. Nope. Just take a little bit of damage. Okay, take a little bit of damage twice. Three times, because why not? What the? Hey, that contact damage right there, I disagree with. That contact damage right there was a little bit too much. We shouldn't have been taking that. That, that shouldn't have been a, a place to take damage. What the fuck? Okay, that's fine. Uh, give me this. Wait, this is the crocodile that took the... Oh my god, are we gonna take that down? How do you work now? Wait, did we stop it? You guys remember the clock, right? Like, uh, when... when we, we, with Peter Pan movie, like, there was a clock that would trigger the crocodile every single time. I don't know, I don't know if you guys are fans of Peter Pan, but I think that was pretty cool. Uh, increase the damage tail by charge attacks. I mean, we're just gonna keep increasing it all the way until the end. We don't know, we don't know, we don't know what's gonna happen. We know that we have charge attacks and that we haven't used them at all. So maybe we should start using them. Are you kidding? Yeah, he's dead. No, no, not a problem. That's why we have so many pirates. In the back. Yeah, he's dead. Yep, not standing a chance. Keep moving forward. Just don't worry about it. What is this? Snakes? No, a crocodile to the left. So we could go down. Just to look for some extra fairies. Wait, what are we gonna have in here? I mean, I remember this. Okay, I remember coming this way, but but what, what, what is even the point? Because there's, there's actually no point to this. Unless there's going to be a power that we're going to get in here. Which I do hope that we get. Yo, there's no power. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, okay, so my guess is that we go up here. Okay, let's fight this guy. Okay, nope, not a worries. Just dodge that, and then now. Freaking flying monkeys. Nobody likes flying monkeys, don't you understand? Like, what is the point of flying monkeys? This place is so weird. I do not get it. Uh, oh, there's there must be something in here, right? No? Okay, it's just a light. I thought for a second that I was gonna outsmart the game, and since there was a light right there, I was like, oh. Maybe it is one of those sections where you can actually... Yeah, dodge that. Nope, no, nope, nope, nope. I'm not even worried about your powers. What the fuck? Okay, that's fine. Those are some traps. Are you guys gonna come my way? If you guys come my way, I'll kill you both. Okay, let's time to, time to fight. Oh, what the? Yo, monkey! Okay, careful. No! Did we fall? What? What was, what was that? I mean, we were going all the way up, no problems, and then suddenly the game falls like that. I mean that that didn't that didn't seem okay. Uh okay, I mean sure. Sure, sure, sure. No no problems. No problems. Just careful. Grab this. Jump up. Grab it again. Jump up. Double jump. Dodge that. Beautiful. Grab this. Nope. Nice. Now we kill that monkey that was pissing me off. Every single monkey in this game, annoying. Uh, we can just keep moving. We have water. I do not understand those signs. But I'm just gonna go with my gut. And my gut says that this is the correct way. We have the crocodile. Uh, so then we go this way. We get more mirrors. And I guess mirrors are good. And then which way are we going? What are we trying to do in here? Is there a way for us to go back? Uh, careful. Though Those traps would have gotten me right there. Okay, we can go fast once again. Wait, is there any point on doing all of this? What did we what did we what did we achieve by coming this way? I don't think we achieved anything. Wait, what happens if we go this way? Why is there fire below us? 
Oh, it's a mine. Okay, I'm confused. This place is what? Two, three, four, five. Wait, are these the? Are these the? Um, are these the dwarves of Snow White? They do look. They do be looking like the dwarves of Snow White, don't they? Talking about that, do you guys understand what the heck is this place taking me to? I don't. I don't get this place. It's like confusing. This place is really confusing. There's a boss fight over there, I believe. Uh, okay, we missed that, and I'm, I'm gonna, and I'm gonna go back for it because there's a goodie, and once you see shiny, you cannot unsee it. Like that's 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 my problem. Know what I'm saying? Is like once I see a shiny, I have to stick to it, and there is nothing that I can do about it. There you go. We grab the shiny. Now I can be happy. The worst part is that it only counts for like three enemies, so it's nothing. There's nothing too special about it. We did see what it, what it looks like to be a boss fight. Maybe it's not a boss fight. I mean, I think it's a boss fight because it seems like a... It's not double jumping. I'm sorry. For some reason. Double jumping here. Double jumping here. Great. See that? There's a school in there. So... That's cool. Uh, I do not know if... I've, I'm not sure if that was exactly what we're supposed to do. That's the axe. Is this the thing? Yes! I do Max, not know how, but I'll take it. Can you make it. it usable with your weird magical bug sorcery? I certainly can. It will become a weapon of supreme power. Sure, sure. Just get on with it. With this, you can annihilate anything in your way. Even enemies? Especially enemies. It looks cool. Let's test it out. A B to smash enemies and obstacles, so... And we got an achievement called off with their head. Sure. But now, how am I supposed to use it? I mean, we know that if we go this way, we're going to go back. So my guess is that this is the correct path. And now that we came this way. Oh, look at that. This is where the crab was. Okay, the, 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 the cuts in there were a little bit weird because of the powers, but okay. And then we can actually go back and... Wait. Aren't you supposed to like... Okay, they died pretty quickly. And honestly speaking, it's really hard. I I'm liking this weapon. It hits hard. Not only does it hit hard, but at the same time... What the fuck just happened? Excuse me? Wait, how do I deal with them? Four hits? Yeah, both die. It hits fast, it hits hard, it kills enemies. I mean, it seems to be a good weapon for me. How fast do you kill these guys? Oh, wait, they, they actually like just... Wait, what the... Three hits to kill those guys? I mean, at that point, I just hit them with a normal weapon. Dude, can, can we go this route, though? Okay. I need to kill you. Yeah, you need to die. Then these girls need to die too. Then we can break this and then we'll die. Now, now that we destroyed all of that, what are we supposed to grab from here? Now, there's nothing that we can do in here. So we just gotta keep pushing forward. Again, this section is weird. Like, there is no... There's no clear pathing. And so far, the game has kind of, like, given you some freedom, but at the same time, some, like, clear path as to... What is it that you have to do? So the fact that they stopped doing that and they just gave you this full open place, it's just strange, in my opinion. But I mean, at the very least, we got a new weapon. We were able to get to it, so I guess it is not so bad. There's a lot of crayons in the background instead of spikes. The level of detail in some of the things that happen in this game are interesting. Now, why are these guys showing up in here? How did he hit me? So some enemies are, are... Oh no, we're gonna have to deal with the harpies again? Ah no. That's annoying. Oh, they die with one hit? Wait, it's one hit? Oh, two hits. Okay, so the harpies die in two hits. That's something that I can deal with. Ah. 
How do we? <coughs> Section is annoying. Okay, let's just keep moving forward and let's see. Let's see how do we finish this part. This part, there's no music. It's super quiet. What do you guys think about this section? I, I have that question. This section of honestly feels out of place. Like it feels like the whole dynamic that they started with kind of like went down. Goodbye. Yeah, he's dead. Great. Yeah, it seems like they started with certain dynamic. And then they suddenly said, yeah, you know what? Fuck that dynamic. We're going to change it. I don't know. It just feels weird. Uh, maybe for you guys, this is okay. This is normal. But to me, honestly speaking, it feels a little bit too weird. Uh, we can do this. And then can we grab that? Great. And then once we're in here, what what, what is the point? Oh, maybe I have to grab in here. And then we have to rush up. Is that what's going on? Wow. Sometimes the double jump doesn't want to work. So when the double jump doesn't want to work, it's a little bit too, too intense. Wait, what's going on? Okay, we have to do this one. Oh my god. I thought for a second that I was going to die. I was like, no. Don't take me all the way down. Not again, please. Okay, at the very least, some, some things seems like to be intuitive. Like, once you reach to certain areas, it seems like it's pretty easy to do whatever you need to do. But until you actually see it, like, the, the whole place. And the, the, the contact damage that you receive from some enemies is also strange. But I guess this enemy is pretty big, so I guess it makes sense. What the fuck is that supposed to be? Oh, we can destroy it with one hit. So there should be there should be no problems with that. Let's just keep moving forward and then boss fight maybe uh, against. Oh shit! Can you please die. There you go. Two of them are dead. Now we gotta deal with this one. Wait, how did you shoot at me? Okay, let's go. We almost died right there. Sorry, sorry guys. Sometimes I gotta focus because honestly speaking, the game is a little bit too dark. In like some of the things and the enemies, the way that they hit is a little bit wonky from time to time. Uh, we got an achievement uh, for healing. So I guess I guess the achievement is because we healed a lot. Uh, it seems like we're going to go through that hole and like start killing fairies. So let's go. Uh, this place is really dark. Why are the fairies so dark? Aren't fairies supposed to be like nice and friendly and everything was supposed to be pretty and beautiful? Wait, did, did she block me? Okay, she's dead. But she she did really block me. Like, she was insane. I was going at it. She wasn't able to stop me. And then suddenly, black, 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 black. Yeah, goodbye. Uh, yep, let's go. Fairies don't seem to be a problem. Uh, we need to... Okay, so this is some sort of like small gauntlets that we have to deal with. That's fine. Okay, this is fine. Okay, we can do this. Wait, still alive? Wow. Come on, just die. Okay, so you cannot use the strong attacks against them. It seems like the moment that you try to use a slow, a strong attack, it's too slow and they just decide to block it. And if they block it, you're pretty much screwed. So you have to take that into consideration. Mm, talking about that. Does anybody else feel like pizza? I don't know why I have this urge of like, I want to eat pizza today. But I cannot eat pizza, so... It will have to be for next week, I believe. <laughs> Give me this. I don't know why, I just suddenly felt like eating a little bit of pizza. Can we break those shields? No, so you have to wait until they disappear. Once they disappear, they become nothing and you can actually kill them. But until the shield actually disappears, you have to fight her. So now, now the game became more linear. Give me your Okay, wait. Careful. Dodge that. Seems to be the boss. Or not the boss, but like their mama. No, they died. Okay, tooth fairies are dead. You did it, kid. I can fly. Good job. It's time for my second wish. I want to be rich. Absolutely rolling in it. Steal the pirate treasure. And make sure you kill all those freebooters. I don't want them chasing me to get it back. Of course, no survivors. 
Who cares as long as you get your wish, right? It is what it is. Oh, uh, we can fly too. What? Wait. How do you... Oh, okay. I mean, this is becoming interesting. This is going to be a fantastic play to wrap things up. Next time, we're going to be stealing the treasure of those pirates. We're going to be taking care of it. Good deal. And then go like that genie and just move with it. I don't know. I had to clap. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like. See you guys next time. Goodbye.